Also tonight, an undercover crackdown happening right now on those who peddle fake Final Four merchandise. The NCAA has millions at stake and licensing police want to make sure there's no criminal infringement on that bottom line. Eyewitness News reporter Marvin Hurst has more on the counterfeit crackdown and the fans who want to avoid the scam. Our journey begins with those who are trying to buy authentic NCAA merchandise. The entrance of the Final Four Music Fest is a bonanza of official NCAA merchandise. Walls filled with t-shirts and Jayhawk blue, red and black, and wow, look at the customers raiding the racks. Jackie Matillus is one of those fans with a team and a mission. Y'all tourists for Final Four? Yes, we are. Yeah. Yeah. Any team specifically? Oh, boy, oh, uh. Yeah. yeah. Totally. You gotta go with the underdog. And y'all came to buy Final Four merchandise? We did. Yeah. Yep, gotta get it while we can so we can wear it all weekend. <laughs> Jackie learned her lesson about buying gear that didn't hang in official venues like this one with the Michigan t shirt. Oh, wait, there's a celebration coming up right here. Hey, you! Rock hey, you. Jayhawks! Of course! Uh -huh. Speaking of celebration, there are those who are happy to peddle this kind of merchandise for a quick buck out of backpacks, trash bags, and trunks. At that moment, sure, the deal is better than the one you'll get here, but in the end, you're hurting the universities. It's inferior product, it's low quality. Um, also, royalties from official sales go back to support the uh, NCA and participating uh, universities and their scholarship funds. And it's against the law. Arnold says that they've hired undercover operatives who are hidden in the crowd, wearing plain clothes just like you and me. You won't know who they are unless you're selling fake gear. By the way, the good stuff has the holograms on it. The authorities would rather you follow Steve Whitney's example. How you feel about that shirt you just got? I like it. Yeah, I like it. Yeah. Official? Official. And the example of so many other college hoop fans lining up for the official gear. We are going to move to where this all matters, the cash register. And the estimated $15 million the NCAA will make on merchandise by the end of the Final Four. Our journey ends with your choice. Will you buy fake gear or not? Marvin Hurst, Kins 5, Eyewitness News.